Um, I got into teaching because I was inspired by a teacher. Um, first grade was when I was first inspired and I was like, this is what I want to do. Um, I stayed with it because the reward is the kids, you know, getting the information and they're like excited, like, thank you, we understand this now. Or, oh, that makes sense. So I, I'm rewarded when, when they get what I'm trying to teach them. I love working with kids and I love athletics and I wanted to find a way to um, bring the love of movement and activity to kids who are not quite as, as athletic as I was challenge every day and uh, you know it's very nice that you have new personalities every single year and you see personalities that change and adapt and branch out and you know extend beyond what they originally thought they were capable of. I mean goal setting is huge in my classroom so they always tend to set goals that they know are attainable so I kind of push to raise the bar and maybe you might not reach it now but what happens if you reach it next year rather than just making sure you're meeting the bare minimum of expectations. I wanted to really inspire our youth. I want them, um, I'm, I'm a Vietnamese uh, American immigrant and I believe that America has so much to offer and um, I feel like as an immigrant and seeing the struggles my parents went through that hopefully I can be their positive role model that if I can do it with parents who didn't have an education that hopefully they're inspired to do something with their lives as well. Because my uh, past profession was in law enforcement and within a couple of years in that I started working with juvenile delinquents and in that I noticed that education had failed them so I wanted to get back into another profession teaching to help youth before they got straight onto the wrong path. So then I went back and got my master's in teaching and then I started teaching in Jersey City. I picked Jersey City because I wanted an urban setting to help the students you know stick on the right path and love education.